This project is sponsored by DF Robot. To begin building it, I began to create a Fusion 360 design. The shape of the device is meant to be a rectangular prism, with the LCD facing out, the LED on top, and the micro USB port in the back. I also made a hole that allows for the soil moisture sensors cabling to attach. For the painting portion, I wanted there to be a green base coat with some floral designs on it in yellow. My Fusion 360 design was created to be CNC routed, so I laid out all the parts evenly on a flat surface and generated G-code from the machining paths. Next, I put my material, a sheet of 10.5 inch by 10.5 inch by quarter inch plywood, on my Millwright CNC machine and began cutting out each part. I also sanded down each piece and gave the edges a good rounding to create a better aesthetic. I first collected my materials the CNC routed pieces of plywood, a can of green spray paint, a can of shellac, a little bottle of yellow acrylic paint, some 150 through 400 grit sandpaper, a bottle of wood glue, and a sander. I started by thoroughly sanding each part, gradually using increasingly finer grit sandpaper. After I felt the sanding was sufficient, I glued the bottom, side, and back pieces together. Next, I sprayed each part with two coats of shellac and then applied several even coats of green spray paint. Now that all of the parts were painted, I added the electronic components into the enclosure, fastening them down with hot glue. I also strung the wires for the soil sensor through the hole in the side and connected it to the photon. I added a little compartment in which to store the sensor and wires when not in use. I went to the Particle Photon Cloud IDE and loaded up the attached sketch, flashing it to my photon. The RGB LED on top blinked five times to notify me that it was powered and connected successfully. The code is set up such that when the moisture dips below 15%, the photon sends an event called water, which then triggers an ift applet. I would like to say thank you to the people at DF Robot for sponsoring this project. Without them, this would not have been possible.